Hi everybody, how you doing? Um, it's been a while since I've done a video. I've um, been working quite a lot and I'm back on Monday to Friday now, so I've not had quite as many chances to get out. Uh, but today I am heading down to a place in North Ayrshire called Lynn Falls or Lynn Glen. Uh, somewhere I've never been before. A couple of cracking big waterfalls and some smaller ones as you move up the trail. Uh, so I'm going to head down there today, see if I can get some decent waterfall pictures. Uh, the weather's pretty rotten to be fair. Um, it's kind of showers and the sky's really flat. Um, but I think it's possible to clear up later, um, so I'll maybe try and get somewhere for sunset on the way back home as well. So I'm going to get down here and see if we get any decent shots of some waterfalls. So Lynn Glen is just outside a town called Dalry, uh, which is one of the towns in North Ayrshire. Now, it's not too far from me, it's only about 20 miles or so uh, from where I stay in Greenock. Uh, I'm not quite sure where the waterfalls are, I think they're a bit further up. I can certainly hear one, but I can't see it, so I'd imagine it's probably the biggest one. So I'm going to get down there, it is a bit slippy and wet today, so I'm going to see if I can get right down to the bottom and try and get some really kind of wide shots and really fill the foreground with it. Uh, but it's quite a nice walk so far, I'm quite enjoying it. Uh, a few squirrels about as well, so maybe try and catch one of them on the way back. But first, going to head to this waterfall and see what we get for it. So I hope you can hear me alright. Um, I've managed to make it down to the bottom of the falls and I'll be honest it was absolutely bogging. Like my jeans, shoes, jacket, bag, everything is absolutely stinking in mud. It's a good thing I've got to change of clothes to the car. So what I'm going to do is I'm trying to make my way sort of into the middle of the river just so I can get some of the rapids that are going by uh, in a shot in the foreground. And the spray that's coming off the waterfall is just going, I'm soaking as well as bogging so I'm going to try and do this quite quickly. I'll probably not film as much of it because I don't want the camera to end up in the water. But we'll see what we get out of it. But at the moment, the only thing I reckon I'm going to get is wet feet. <laughs> see what happens. Ooh. Right, let's see if we can get a decent shot. So I've got myself out of the river and I'll be honest, uh, honestly it's, I'm absolutely bogging. Oh. What I'm going to try and do is take a picture from just a wee bit higher up. So I'll be honest, I don't think any of my shots from down the river haven't got big water droplets on them because the spray is just so bad down there. Uh, so I'm going to try for a wee bit higher up just to see if I can get anything decent. Then I'm going to patch it and go to one of the smaller waterfalls because this is just mental. <laughs> Right, so cards on the table. The shoot down at the big waterfall there was nothing short of an absolute shit show. Um, the spray was just so bad. Um, and normally, obviously, these places are really slick because they've got water pouring down them, right? But the mud was just everything you touched, whether it was a branch, a rock, anything, just absolutely covered in it. So I probably stood there for an hour or so, just trying to get something that I was happy with. And eventually, I've just bit the bullet and said, you know what, the day's not the day, there's too much water. So instead, I'm just going to walk back to the car, change my trousers, and then I'm going to head down, I think, to Porton Cross and the hope for a sunset. Uh, there is a wee gap in the horizon there, so we should get something nice. But I'm just looking forward to change my trousers, to be honest, I'm absolutely in my 
Um, so I'll get you back at the car and keep our fingers crossed for a sunset. So I've made it down to Porton Cross and there's a potential that the sky could light up. It's going to, there's two things going to happen here. It's either going to be absolutely spectacular or there's going to be absolutely nothing. And the way my day's going so far, it's probably going to be nothing. The good thing is, is there's some waves coming in. Um, so I'm kind of stuck between two possibilities. One is taking a shot of the actual castle itself or one is trying to get a shot with a long exposure with some of the waves in it. Um, I don't know how that's going to work because Aaron's in the cloud, so I think I'm just going to stand about for the next 10 minutes, sunset's about 15 minutes, so I'm going to stand about for the next 10 minutes, see how the sky's going and then make a decision as to what I'm going to do, but at the moment, who knows. <laughs> So the sun's due to go down in about a minute's time. Um, I've picked a composition with the waves kind of lapping on the rocks uh, with the castle in the background, but realistically, there's not going to be any colour in the sky, I don't think, but it's really quite dramatic, the clouds. So it could actually look for quite a nice moody shot. So I'm just going to stand here, and then after the sun sets, it should get a little bit darker and make it a wee bit more moody looking. Uh, <laughs> it was really looking quite good there for a couple of minutes, but it just pretty much sums the day up, to be honest. <laughs> Uh, we'll stand here for a few minutes and see if we can get in to sort of salvage my whole day. <laughs> Well, as the old saying goes, you win some, you lose some. And that for me was definitely a loss. <laughs> as you can see for the last image, it pretty much flopped as well. There was no colour in the sky. And it didn't even look that dramatic, to be quite honest. Um, nine times out of ten, when you go out and do landscape photography, you'll either come away with something that's absolutely average or nothing at all. Um, but it's that one times out of ten that kind of keeps you coming back doing it. But anyway, that's me for the day. I am going to head back down the road. I'm going to get myself a bottle of wine. I'm going to make some fajitas. I'm going to get a hot shower because I am absolutely bogging. <laughs> Thanks very much for watching the video. Uh, if you enjoyed it, please give it a like. And if you really enjoyed it and want to see some more, then just hit subscribe as well. So thanks very much and I'll see you all later.